You can add a calendar to your website so that you can present important dates to the public. As this is a teacher's website, let's add a calendar that will display the dates of quizzes and tests. We start at the top level of our site and click on the New Web Page button and then double click on Web Calendar. We can change the name to Quizzes and Tests by right clicking on the calendar in the tree view and selecting Properties or Get Info on a Mac and change the name on this form. Since this is a new container, if we want the appearance to be consistent throughout our website, we set the appearance to be the same as the root level appearance, so we click on the Appearance button and select the one that we established for our website. Before we start to enter events into our calendar, we must first set permissions on the calendar so that we can control the content, yet all others can only read and not modify the content. Once again, right-click on the calendar, but this time choose Permissions. By default, the owner has been declared the editor. You can now add one more entry. In the Who section, type All Users, press Tab, and in the Access field, select Schedule and Details. Remove the Delete Own Items and Add Participants, yet Add In, Open Items, and Download Files and Attachments. Once the permissions have been established, you can start to enter events. I can enter an event in this calendar much the same way as I enter events on my own personal calendar. For example, if I have a History Unit 1 test on Monday, December the 12th at 11 a.m., I can double-click on that day to create the event. I can determine that I would like the History Quizzes and Tests to be displayed in orange, so I set the color, and then I set my time. I can enter more information about the test in the document pane below the envelope. And I can also use the Attach button to attach our study guide for this test. We can save and close this event and view it in our web browser. Clicking on the View in Browser button with the calendar selected in the tree view takes us directly to the calendar. And we can click on the event to display more information and, if we like, review the study guide. The breadcrumb trail at the top of the event page allows us to return to the calendar or back to the base home level where we see all of our web items in our navigation pane.